Hi friends, welcome to Wafa Studies YouTube channel. This is part 7 in Python playlist. In this video, we are going to discuss about global variables and also local variables in Python. And also we are going to discuss about global keyword in Python. So first let's discuss about what are local variables in Python. So local variables are the one which you have created inside the function. Once you create any local variable inside the function, you can use it only within the function. Okay. So let me show you this practically. Let me go to Visual Studio Code. Let me click this file menu. Open folder. If you are following this video series, we are working with this Python demo folder in all our videos. So let me select the same folder and then let me click this select folder. So this will open our Python demo folder in the explorer and also it will show you all the python files inside that particular folder so now let me create a new python file here let me name it like demo.py okay so this is our file so let me close this welcome tab here so this is our demo.python file so as i said local variables are the variables which you create inside a function so what is function we haven't discussed about that yet don't worry for no think like function is like a uh, piece of code or a code block which you write and save it with some name and whenever you want to execute it you can call it with that name for example if i want to create a function i will use this defined keyword def then let me give a name for this function like my function then colon so then immediately if you see a new line started here with some indentation so that means this is a code block inside the function so maybe here le let me create a variable so maybe let me say like mahir and then maybe let me print that so these two lines of code what you see here x equals to mahir and print x so these are like within this function code block so all this logic is written inside a function called my function so whenever you want to execute this function you should call it with that name so as i am calling it here so if i want to execute my function logic i should call it by that name so that my python interpreter will execute this logic okay so don't worry about the functions much we are going to discuss about functions in great detail in our upcoming videos so if you see this code right now here we created a variable called x inside the function so that means this x is like a local variable so you cannot use this variable outside the function so right now i am using this variable here in the print statement which is inside the function so this is fine so if i execute this code let me execute this python space demo dot py it is going to print mahir without any issue because whenever the execution comes to this line it is going to execute this logic and it will print that okay but what if after this I want to print that once again like print x so if i try to do this what will happen na? python will complain me about this variable it says like x is not defined variable you can see there is a red line below so what it is complaining is i don't know what is this x variable i have i don't have any idea about this x why why my python is not having the idea about x variable here because this line number six is outside the function and this x variable is created inside the function so this is like a local variable you should use it inside the function only so that is what i have explained in this slide also local variables can be used only inside the function okay so let me go to the second slide here so now let's discuss about what is global variable then so we got an idea local variable is the variable which is inside the function so what is global variable so global variable is nothing but like the variable which is created outside the function so let me create a variable here called like y y equals to maybe like wafa okay so now if i try to print this y here this print statement will not compile compliant about y because it knows y is nothing but a variable which is created in this program since it is created outside the function this is like a global variable so anywhere you can access this variable here so not only here i think i can access it inside the function also let me say this print y see see what i am doing i am printing x also inside the function and also i am printing y also inside the function so let me remove this print statement from here 
now let me execute this and show you the results what will happen so let me type this python.demo.py now it printed both mahir and wafa so how that happened whenever the line execute this line executes it will execute all this code so it prints x and also it is able to print y also why because y is like a global variable so anywhere in the program you can use that variable to access the value inside it okay so that that is what global variable is so global variables are created outside the function and this can be used anywhere both inside and outside the function okay so what if if i create a global variable and local variable with the same name will it get replaced for example i have a lo lo global variable called y so what if if i create a global variable y here also so what i am trying to do i created another variable called y inside my function also <coughs> here also i have a variable with y as a global variable so what will happen will it replace this value of a will it override let's see that so what i am going to do to know that after this my function execution i am going to print that value by once again here so inside the function the value inside y is mahir outside the function the value inside y is wafa so let's see what will happen let let's save these changes and then let's execute so if you observe it printed both mahir and wafa how that happened what happened is behind actually this variable and this variable both are different actually so this is local variable though the name is same this is like a local variable and this is like a global variable so when you try to print y inside the function it is actually printing this local variable because that is inside the function and when you try to print y outside the function which is a, which is actually printing this y so which is a global variable so these two variables are actually different because their scope of creation is completely different okay so that is fine uh, what if if i want to override this i mean uh, i should be able to create global variables inside the function and also i should be able to change the value of a global variable inside the function how should i do that to do that there is something called global keyword you should use this keyword to create any global variable inside the function also if you want to change the value of a global variable inside the function still you should use this global variable key, global keyword sorry so let me show you that practically how it is so for example y equals to wafa here so this is a global variable now i want to change the value of this global variable inside the function so what i should do is i should use a global keyword here and then change the value of it like y equals to maybe mahir okay so once i once i do that now let me execute this code i am trying to print this uh, y value here outside my function outside my function right so let's see what it will print so let me run this python code see it printed mahir i created a global variable with value as wafa but inside the function i changed the value as mahir using this global keyword so when the execution comes to this line it will execute this logic and uh, it will refer to the global variable y and it will change the value in value of that variable as mahir and that's what it is getting printed here okay so and also as i said what if if i want to create a global variable the same thing use a global keyword so i don't have any variable y created outside of my function i am directly creating a variable called y inside the function using a global keyword and i am assigning a value to it and i am trying to print that y outside of my function so will is this if it is a local variable it will give error by this time saying y is not defined but since i declared it with a global keyword it is actually like a global variable and it will print the value here so let me run this and show you so let me python.demo.py see it printed so that is how using global keyword you can either create a global variable inside a function also you can change the value of a global variable inside the function okay so this video will be little confusing to understand like global variable local variable and all i will suggest to watch once or twice this video until you get a proper idea so once you get the idea in your mind it is very easy going forward whenever you see any complex code in your project or if you want to write some complex code it will be very easy for you to work with all these variables thank you for watching this video please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to get the notifications whenever i add videos thank you